Yo guys, so it's your boy Jordan here coming back at you today with a brand new video and today I've got a bit of a different type of video for you guys Today I'm actually going to be taking you guys through a, a full day of eating for me what I typically eat in a day and this diet I'd say I've been on for probably around 10, the last 10, 10 to 10, 9 months or so so yeah, I'm going to try to pop up the macros on the screen for each meal um, and I should all oh, know you're spoiling my video yeah where was I um, I'm going to try to pop up the macros on the screen and I should note that I am been in a bulk or a, or a caloric surplus during this time so the calories are relatively high but yeah I'm going to have a good uh, gym session during the day as well I hope you enjoyed that part of the video but yeah it should be a good one guys Come on. all right the kitchen where the magic happens first meal of the day let me do this this and you're gonna see this filled up in three two one. So yeah guys, as you can see on the screen, breakfast is served. Oats, a banana, a few grams of goji berries over here. So these ones right here are multivitamins. You don't necessarily need multivitamins, but I just like to cover all bases. If you have like a good, well-rounded um, diet, Chances are you're getting most of the stuff in there already, but as I said, I just like to cover all bases and make sure I'm getting a good amount of everything. These here, these little see-through jellies, it's not gonna focus, maybe not. These little see-through jelly type pills are called fish oils. They're just great for your internal organs, great for joint health, heart health, um, help keep your vision nice and strong as well, supposedly. Um, and this here is just this is just a hay fever tablet that time of year, not fun. Um, over here, my amazing, my amazing Spider-Man mug. It's just a green tea. And over here, a protein shake, 200 milliliters of almond milk. And yeah, 600 calories to start the day. So yeah, 600 calories to start the day, guys. I don't like to get too crazy with breakfast. I like to keep it a bit lighter, especially if I'm normally gonna go train afterwards. So yeah, I like to keep that a bit lighter. My other meals throughout the day, you'll see the calories, they start getting a bit more intense. Um, also ignore the little 3000 calorie thing on top of the screen, it's just part of that. Spoiler alert, I eat a lot more than 3000 calories, so you'll see that. But yeah, gonna get cracking with the day, let's go.
when I turn up the bass. Guys, the session was good, some shoulders and triceps, feeling stronger by the week. I think this is the third week back now in the gyms. Yeah, no, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling strong. But yeah, next week, I'm not gonna be able to eat like I am any, like I currently am, I should say. Start the cut, gonna ease into it, not gonna go in straight into the deep end. But yeah, no. Actually looking forward to it, gotta get the body right for the summer. Haven't seen the abs in a while, so. Should be a good one. So yeah, guys, nothing special. You'll see all the macros on the screen, just some scrambled eggs, some beans, nice chicken sandwich, protein yogurt, a glass of orange juice. Gonna get this down, me. Hungry. Yo, guys, 
So it's been a few hours since I last ate the last meal you saw. Now, the final full meal of the day. Some rice, some plain grilled chicken, just some salt and pepper. And some chopped up salad, avocados, spinach, cucumber, tomatoes. And just a little protein bar for after. You know what's funny about this chicken? I remember all the time when I was in school and in like sixth form and that. Every time I tell people, like, I do one of my meals meal prepped, because this meal, I normally meal prep it, like the weekend before, for, throughout the week. So I got at least one, like, ready meal to save time. Um, when I used to tell them my chicken used to be plain, the first thing I'll get is laughs and people being like what but people need to understand i just need my chicken to be a clean cut protein source just clean that's why it's grilled and there's no like crazy seasoning on it um i don't know i just thought i would share that because like you know there's a reason i look the way i do and the reason you look the way you do if it was up to me i would just put all the seasonings under the sun on my chicken and enjoy it sauces everything but you gotta make sacrifices to look this way man but yeah it is what it is this is my last full meal of the day you'll see the macros on the screen or well, they may have passed already i don't know we'll see where the editing goes but yeah probably in about after i finish this in about an hour's time i'm gonna make a shake and then i'll show you what I put in that to really bump the calories up for the day. So yeah, stay tuned. So yeah guys, as you can see, just made that shake. I've got it over here. And a little banana as well. So yeah, that's basically my full day of eating. Um, I've generally ate this same like little combination of meals for maybe even two years at this point. But last year when a gym shut in the first lockdown, I took a little break from it, I cut the calories down because I wasn't really doing much intense exercise so there was no point in me eating close to 4,000 calories so but yeah this is my last week actually doing this and I'm going on my first proper cut in two years so looking forward to see how we can get the physique looking haven't seen the abs in a while um don't know man it's going to be interesting to see what I look like with a considerable going to be interesting to see what I look like with a considerably lower body fat percentage hopefully I look good been putting in the work so yeah but guys I hope you enjoyed the video the macros for that shake would have been on the screen a little bit ago and yeah make sure to like comment subscribe share the videos helps out so much keep supporting the channel keep supporting your boy and yeah I'm out guys Thank you.